Charles, you said it the other night. If if you were told after the game that Kevin Durant was going to go 10 for 30, and, yeah, it, but yeah. and Russell Westbrook was going to go seven for 21, you'd say how many did they lose by? Yeah, and uh, you know what? They got to be a little bit more efficient because Golden State is going to play better because Oklahoma City Thunder is only going to go as far as those two guys. The Steph and Clay going to play better because they're the best backcourt, arguably in NBA history. But Russell and Kevin got to be more efficient. I think this is going to be a long series because what your stars do, what Akeem Olajuwon allowed Kenny to do, is be a hero. What you and Kobe did allow Rick, Rick Fox, Derek Fisher, because when your stars play well, you have to slant your defense toward those stars. Kenny says something. Everybody talked about the Golden State Warriors' a sister down. That was called that was no Steph Curry because he gives you guys an extra five assists a game when he's penetrating or making a because he gives everybody space. But Kevin and Russell got to be more efficient. They they got a great win the other night, but uh, I expect them to play better tonight and the rest of the ser rest of the series. You know, one or two games here, three, three games, three games in this gym building this year. You you really haven't lost back to back games all At year. All. Yeah. Uh, so why would you panic? You, you know, the one thing that you could say is again, I think the message to Steve Kerr was was very directed more at Draymond Green. We've seen Steph Curry take quick shots. We've seen Klay Thompson take quick shots at times. But I don't think through a course of a game we saw Draymond Green ever do that this year. Um, and I thought he was a little out of character. Uh, and when he gets back into character, it allows them to all flourish. I expect a Golden State win today, but this is going to be a, a great series because you're not going to win, Shaq. This and not win on the road. You're not going to win well, the Western Conference Finals or the NBA Finals and not win on the road. You can, you know, if you have home court advantage. I mean, you know, I, you know, I've actually, you know, done that before. But today is a simple case of focus versus bounce back. OKC, are you focused enough to say, you know what? We don't want to split. We want to duplicate all the good we did in Game One. We're five and one this postseason. When five guys average ten points. We got to trust and utilize the others. And again, in the last two minutes, Kevin Durant, I didn't like that. He went over seven and he hit the big shot. He either has, you know, he either has to mix it up, penetrate, get better shots. Because, you know, if you miss those shots and Golden State hit those shots, we're having a different conversation. And then, you know, for Golden State, bounce back. Draymond Green, everybody, you know, playing their role, doing what they're supposed to do, not taking the quick shots, hitting the shots. I agree with you, Chuck. Golden State, they're going to come out like gangbusters tonight. But. OKC, okay, I'm anxious to see what their focus is. Are they going to be happy with the split? Or do they say, nope, we got them where we want them now. Let's just go and knock them out, take care of business.